update to Kate with the April 9th, 2021 news. The Horizon High School Spirit Line will be hosting summer clinics for the 2021 to 2022 season tryouts. These clinics will be held during the month of June on Monday or Wednesday nights. We are also offering interested cheer and palm athletes to attend the TSC summer camp with the HHS Spirit Line to sign up for our email list and read through our information on the summer clinics TC, TSC camp and tryout date requirements, please go on the horizonspiritline.com and click on the tryout tab. Now to Mr. Hummer and Trey with the announcements. Good morning, Sidewinders. This is Mr. H in the new studio. I came here today to offer a few thanks and celebrations to a lot of hard work that's happened this week. I know we all feel a little better going back to the regular uh, bell schedule and we've just completed our three days of testing. I would like just to say a few kind things about Mrs. O'Boyle and Mrs. Somar. They are our testing coordinator and director at Desert Shadows Middle School. I believe that they put together a successful plan for our group of in-person testers from Tuesday to Thursday of this week. So I want to thank them for all the technical work that they did to put our teachers and students in a position to be successful. The second group I want to thank is our teachers. Uh, this uh, state testing is not an easy thing. There's a lot of technical um, precision type things that our teachers have to be able to do in order for all of our students to be scored properly. And we had a very high success rate with those who tested. Naturally, we still have some makeup tests to do and those will be done for both our in-person learners and our PD Connect students. Uh, but overall, it's been a very successful week. And I want to thank our teachers and uh, especially Mrs. O'Boyle and uh, Mrs. Somar for that. Of course, uh, the most important component of this is our students. And when we walked into the classrooms over the course of the week, we found our students uh, focused, generally reporting that they're giving their best effort, and we certainly appreciate that. We will see our test results this summer. They will go out to parents and to schools. Not a lot of high pressure this year, given all that we've been through with the pandemic, but thank you for all of your efforts. The second group I'd like to acknowledge is our National Junior Honor Society students and sponsors. NJHS is a component of the state's National Honor Society at the high school level, and each year we induct about 100 uh, or 120 students who meet a very high threshold for grades and character. We've postponed the induction ceremony until next week, but I want to thank all of the students who've earned their way and who've participated in NJHS up until this point, and I want to give a special kudos and acknowledgement to Mrs. Reese and Mr. Zapeta, the um, NJHS sponsors. We look forward to a very special induction ceremony next Thursday uh, on April uh, 15th. You have earned it. We appreciate you. And those are my acknowledgments today. Thank you, be kind, and be brave. Hey, DSMS, let's try with the birthdays. The birthdays from Thursday to Sunday are Layla Trinidad, Benton Lockhart, Tatum Stevens, Havian Farrell, Hannah Felker, Noah Felker, Ty Dozy, Daisy McGeady, Samuel Sinclair, Jack Dominguez, Madeline Mastin, and Hunter Walker. Sorry if I mispronounced any of your names. Now to Alex with the lunch. It's time for lunch! What time is it? It's time for lunch! Hi, it's Alex with the lunch. Today we have mini corn dogs, glazed chicken drumstick with a wheat roll, and a fruit and cheese pack. Now to Maya with the weather. Hi, it's Maya with the weather. Today we have a high of 93 and a low of 61 with a 0% chance of rain, 18% humidity, and 1 mile per hour winds. Now back to the anchor. Hey, I'm back. There's lunch bunch today for 7th and 8th grade today. Have a great day. 